This one is for all my new year, new me people. Here are some tips so you hopefully don't shit the bed in 2019. One of the biggest faults people have when they go into these New Year's resolutions or New Year, New Me bullshit is that they overthink everything that they want to do. Stop it. Create goals that are realistic for yourself and not goals because Billy Bob did it, but goals for yourself. If the goals aren't realistic, you're probably not going to follow through with whatever goal you came up with. Now, while going through your journey or your goal, another thing I really, really want you to do is stop being so impatient. Understand that any goal that you have or whatever you're doing, it's a process. So with this process, we also have to have a plan. Because if we don't have a plan, you don't know where the hell you're going. And with that plan, you need someone to keep you held accountable. Now, if you're someone who's independent, you're probably, ah, screw that, I don't need anyone. And that's cool. But for many of you, you need someone there to keep you accountable so that you don't fall off the rails. And also, someone to call you on your shit when you start being an asshat. It's great to have someone there anyway because they're gonna help you be consistent. One of the other huge things that I like to talk about with clients and with all of you is one simple, simple word. You ready for it? You ready? Balance. Having a balanced approach to your exercise, a balanced approach to your nutrition, especially nutrition, because if you just keep telling yourself you can't have this or you can't do that, Guess what? Your brain's gonna be more apt to driving you batshit crazy to eat whatever that you're not supposed to be eating. So if you have a balance, you allow yourself that flexibility to eat things that aren't necessarily healthy, but it also keeps you sane. Try working in a 70-30 split with your balance. 70% of the time, you behave. 30% of the time, you make sure that you're not going crazy. Last but not least, Probably one of the most important things that I would say that you must do, not if or whatever, must do, is concentrate on the circle around you and make sure that the people around you are supporting your goals and whatever that you want to do to better yourself. If you have little negative Nancys around trying to throw a wrench in your plan, things will be a little bit more tough. Now, I'm not saying that getting rid of negative people is easy, but at the same time, if these people consistently give you problems in your life, they're probably really not worth having around. Those are my very subtle tips for those of you fitting in the New Year, New Me category. Thank you for watching, for liking, subscribing, for sharing, for commenting, and all that fun stuff. If you have anything that you'd like me to make a video about, feel free to write in the comments or DM me, and I'll be more than happy. So until next time, people, stay cool and don't be a dick.